20 years. You are, you are into uh, the elite group now. In fact, you are the only woman to have done the Olympic sprint double back to back. And only your legendary compatriot Usain Bolt has gone that distance among all of the athletes. He has done it three times at three Olympic Games. How aware were you of the magnitude of the achievement to be gotten coming into this final? Honestly, my focus was just going to go through the round safely. We had two challenging nights yesterday, which we came out to do the, the semis and the heats, which I've never done before. I called my PD last night. We still have not recovered fully to come back out here and to run a national record. I think I could have gone faster if we had another day from the heats, but I'm happy, I'm amazing to be in this record book and this history book. That is amazing. This is frightening, the form you're showing at the moment. It's scary to say the least, that you are saying you could have gone faster had you had more recovery. But many are wondering, Elaine, how do you come out here and run 21.53 out of five rounds? I have no idea. God have my back. I've prayed to him every single day. If I had my phone to you right now, every day that I train, I have everything written down. More than 10 aims, more than 10 things that I believe in. And I talk it, I say it, I believe in it. And I wish I could show you, but I'll show you some other time. This was a part of it. I can take this off now because I've achieved this. There's more to achieve. And last year, I written them down last year. We had a setback. I pushed them forward to this year. And I just continue to work, work, work. I was out here, and I heard Shenzhen song in my head, just run, 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 run. I would just keep on running until I reach the line. Coach Steve Francis said about uh, two or three weeks ago, you're in the shape of your life. Can you get into any better shape than this? Probably, <laughs> but uh, after this, I just to see what more is in the leg, and I think my season in September, so there is more to come, even though there's nothing more to prove. I have some more diamond leagues to complete, so probably next year, hopefully. All right, let's go to the race itself now. Talk to us about it from the start. You really shot or exploded out of those blocks. I have not seen the video. I was looking to see the video, but I have not seen the replay. But the main here must get off early because everybody was behind. And I'm the target, so I have to get off early and they follow. Because normally I'm not a person to lead a pack. <laughs> but tonight I have to get off the curve fast as possible and just maintain. This historic sprint double, back-to-back uh, -back sprint double at the Olympics for a woman, what exactly does it mean to you, Elaine? It means a lot to me. I've never seen this day, even though my dream was to make the Olympic and I've never seen myself get another double. I've never get a, I've never broken 21 for the last past, past five years. And I've done that twice this championship. This means a lot to me to be a part of the record book, the history book. I mean, there's a lot of athletes for the boys and girls champs. I know they are watching and this, I set a, a standard for them. I know they want to be, they want to achieve this moment hopefully one day. So for me to set that standard, I feel great. You're still pretty young at what, 27? 29. So, 29, sorry. So uh, Paris 2024, in terms of the triple double, are you looking forward to that and even UG next year, world champs? Definitely, I'll be 33 for Paris and I'm looking forward. I actually read that down for the next three years. So yes, it's a part of it. I'm continuing to, to set my focus and keep working. The sprint relay is uh, heat's coming up now in two days' time. Has the coaching staff said anything to you? What's happening there? Pretty much they said focus on your race. So tomorrow, hopefully, I should just get a brief. This is not what they had. And well, it's a brother, so we want that go. So anything, I'm going out there. You have given Jamaica its fifth medal at these championships. So set both gold medals so far for Jamaica. You have garnered those. What do you think this will do for the morale of the Jamaican camp in the village at this time? Honestly, I know a lot of them, they have worked hard and they may have been a little bit disappointed. I was, disapp I was once disappointed at, 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 at a point of a championship, but I'm just saying, you know, you can't do well on that. Sometimes disappointment has to come and that helps you to motivate you a little bit better further in the future. So this will help them to be better and stronger. If the handovers are done correctly and everything uh, falls into place, how possible is it that Jamaica can break the sprint relay world record? Honestly, every year we went as a team to have button pass practice. We always go there and freestyle, but this one is just us to carry the button safely around. And if we can get the record, definitely we we go for that. Talk to your family members and friends back home at this time now. Honestly, I want to thank everyone for supporting and believing me. I know my husband is watching, my grandmother, of course, my cousins, my friends, my families, my father, my mother. Everybody and also shop golden trend big up HMP music production and eat with us at At our restaurant Elaine, Elaine a stunning achievement by any stretch of the imagination Great 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 performances continue to do well all the very best
for the remainder of these Olympic Games and the future. Thank you. Big up. Bless. And I said, smile.